Hey crew, it's Ben, and I'm back with another reaction. Today we're going to be checking out Jelly Roll and Craig Morgan performing Almost Home live at the Grand Ole Opry. Let's dig in and see what's up. I did not transition that for y'all. Y'all got to be able Thank to see you very this much. too. All right, let's go. How exciting is Jelly Roll, y'all? This song, like, I know you don't react to songs that I've heard before, right? But Almost Home was a favorite of mine growing up. Like, I love this song. So I can't wait to see Jelly Roll and Craig Morgan perform this. Like, I love Jelly Roll. So listen, if you haven't seen it, you need to go back and pull it up on YouTube or find the, his first appearance. I happened to be out on the road somewhere and someone called me and said, man, you have got to see this Jelly Roll guy. He was just on this Jelly Roll guy. Your boy sound country as cornbread, I tell you what. On the Grand Ole Opry. And he don't look like somebody that would be on the Grand Ole Opry. <laughs> but he was... I'm, I personally, I know there's a lot of gatekeepers out there, but I personally am not upset that people with face tattoos and, you know, eccentric styles are making it into the Grand Ole Opry. I'm, I'm really not upset at all. Talking about you. And so I went back and I watched it and I watched him. He was standing up here and he was talking about how when he was in jail and struggling how a particular song helped him get through it and he mentioned the fact that he came to the grand Ole opry when he got out and i remember it he said i was sitting right over there with that gentleman in that hat is sitting in the seventh row right inside and craig morgan was singing on stage and it moved me it moved me it just proved exactly what he said that music can change lives so there's no better feeling in the world than somebody telling you that you helped change their life before I do the song that he said changed his life, I would love it if y'all would give him a big round of applause and get him to come back out here and sing this with Come on, Jelly. I can't be too loud, right? Hey, my boy. I pray for this man by name every day. Y'all make some noise for the living legend, Mr. Craig Morgan. Shortly after I got out of jail, I did. I sat right there in row seven and I cried like a baby and watched him sing. And I remember thinking. Don't do it, bro. It's too early. You're going to make me cry too early. I want to make people feel the way he makes me feel right now. Get you some. This is a true testimony that God is real and all things are possible. Amen. Ah, that's what that I'm talking about. That was in jail and struggling. His wife is sitting right there. And he's not sitting there tonight. That kid is standing next to Craig Morgan. <laughs> Get you Here some. we go, buddy. Let's do it. Come on. He had plastic bags wrapped around his shoes. He was. Covered in the evening news, had a pair of old wool socks on his hand. Come on, boy. The bank sign was flashing by below. Huh. He was freezing rain and spitting snow. He was curled up beside some garbage cans. Huh. Five below is cold, y'all. I have to break it up, y'all know that, right? I know it's about to get emotional. Like, this song really strikes me because there was a time I was ready to go home, right? There's been several times in my life that I was I was ready to go home. And even today, like, I'm not in the point today where I'm like, you know what, I'm going to try to go home. But I am at the point where I'm like, you know what, if I go home, it's all right. I've lived a good life. I've raised good kids. I've had a great life. And if I went home, it would be all right. So, like, this is going to be emotional. When he opened up his eyes, he said, Oh man, are you okay? And he said, I just climbed out of a cottonwood tree. I was running from some honeybees. Trip trying in the sun. Yeah. 
It hits. It really does. Like it hits different now than it did th what thirty years ago now. Cause I would just climb down out of that cedar tree and jump into Redwood Creek, but we walked down an old dirt road past them fresh mowed peels. Like it, it hits because it was my childhood. The good parts of my childhood was all wrapped up right there in that song. Every good part of my childhood was right there. He said I was just crawling around the barn About the time you grabbed my arm And I heard Mama holler something I was close enough for my own nose To smell fresh cover on the stove I saw Daddy loading up the truck Tilgate, bobbers blowing in the wind Since July of 85, that's as close as I've been Yeah, I just climbed out of a cottonwood tree Is there any better spell in the world than fresh cut hay? Yeah. I'm trying to change my own mood just a little bit, right? Whew. But there ain't no better. Like, if you are in the city and you have never been <clears throat> and smelled fresh cut hay, like, like fresh cut hay and when they turn it, when they dry it, it's, there's no better smell in the world. It's like freshness unleashed. It's great. Man, I wish you just left me alone. Cause I was almost home. I said, old oh, man, you're gonna freeze to death. Let me drive you to the mansion. He said, man, that's the plan. Said, boy, if you left me alone. Come on, son. Bring it on. Just me and you. Just climbed out of a cottonwood tree. I was running from some honeybees. Drill trying in the summer breeze. After jumping in the calico creek. Get your thoughts, bro. Get your thoughts. And I wish you just left me alone. Cause I was almost home. It's just yeah. Romeo. I was almost home. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. That was absolutely beautiful. Hey, I, got, I got something for you, Jim. That was absolutely beautiful. I loved that. I love that. We're going to watch the rest of this. I'm going to break it up for just a second. I want to put this out there. If you are watching this, 
then your mission is not over and you do not get to decide when to go home. Like, no matter who you are, no matter where you are, you don't get to decide when to go home. You inspire me. Uh, you did when I heard that. I mean, I sat on the bus and cried. And, and I knew how important that song was to you, so I, I hand wrote a set of lyrics for you to the song and signed it to you. And I want you to hang this up next to all them gold and platinum and multiple platinum records uh, that we know you're going to keep having, buddy. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. God is good all the time. All the time. Yes, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry I ugly cried up here again, but I just... <laughs> So I thank you so much to me, all the power of music. Make some noise for Craig Morgan. Thank you for having me, Mr. Morgan. Thank you, buddy. Good on you, gentlemen, both of you. That was very well done. Let me go ahead and pause that, and we'll get the transition over. Y'all make sure y'all get back over to Jelly's Rules page and give him a like, share, and a sub. Throw him all the love that you can. I know Jelly Roll is much bigger than I am, and I might get one over there, but one is always more than none. So let's give it a shot. This was absolutely amazing. Jelly Roll, Craig Morgan, I thank you so much for this. This was great music, and it was greatly appreciated. It took me down a very nostalgic trip. It was so great, so great. Like, I grew up in the country, right? The best parts of my, like, we've talked, like, I grew up all over the place. Like, all over the place. I moved around a lot. I went to five different kindergartners. But the best memories of my, my childhood were at my grandmother's house, out in Boondock, Ethel, Louisiana, right? And we had nothing but cow pastures and churches. Like, that was it. There was one store, there was three churches, and there was cows. And it was great. And that brought me down that memory lane. Like, I could smell the hay. And it's spring down here. I know some of y'all still dealing with snow, but down here in Louisiana, like, I got to get out here and cut my grass because it's getting out of hand. So, Jelly Road, Craig Morgan, thank you so much for this. This was absolutely amazing. To the crew, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate every single minute that you are here with me, and I am praying for you every single day. Until next time, I love you. You are perfect, whole, and complete, just the way that you are. And this has been Pitt State. Peace.